In this session, you learn the difference between refundable and non-refundable credits. We then introduced you to some of the most common non-refundable credits, namely the child tax credit, the child and dependent care credit, and education credits, which include the American Opportunity and Lifetime Learning credits. You learn the rules for each of these credits and the forms that must be completed in order to claim them. Now read Chapter 5 of your workbook, then answer the questions and complete the learning activity found at the end of the chapter. Remember to check your work in the appendix. Once you have completed the learning activities, continue your progress by starting Session 6, a continuation of our discussion on non-refundable credits. Here are the tax-saving tips for Chapter 5. 1. Take advantage of the various education credits and deductions for your client's own or children's college expenses. 2. For high-income clients whose AGI is above the phase-out limit for education credits, consider shifting the education credits to the child for which the education was paid by not claiming the child as a dependent. Often the benefit of the credit is higher than the value of the withholding amount.